Hey y'all, Carpetbagger here, coming to you live from the Arctic North. More specifically, Middleton, Wisconsin, and even more specifically than that, I am right outside of the National Mustard Museum. Now what is a mustard museum? I'm not entirely sure. I don't know if it's old, antiquated mustard, if it's some sort of scientific mustard research center. I do know is uh, the gentleman that, that runs the museum. I think his name is Barry Levinson, and he just claimed that he is the king of mustard. He was actually on the TV show, a show called My Strange Obsession, a few years back I had watched, and apparently he brushes his teeth with mustard, and if he's around ketchup, he has an anxiety attack. <laughs> anyway, let's, let's check out the museum. Follow me. So here it is. The Mustard Museum. Here's some mustard seeds. Sas Saskatchewan is the mustard capital of the world. Oh, why is the museum here then? Mustard from Zanzibar? There is the owner, Barry Levinson. The first 27 virtues of mustard. Adventurous, articulate, confident, graceful. This is slightly insane. These are all squeeze bottles of mustard from around the world. Ew. Who'd want to eat mustard out of a bag? That's just weird. Europe mustard. You know, you can't deny, that is a lot of mustard. Oh, North Carolina mustard. Oh wow, they actually have Lusty Monk. That's my favorite mustard ever. You know, this is mustard from every state in the Union. Some Vidalia onion mustard. I wonder if Funyun has ever visited the Mustard Museum. So here's some really old mustard. There's pure mustard oil. There's a little mustard man. And some mustard flavored candy. Some Disney mustard. Colonel Mustard and Mean Mr. Mustard. Look at all this mustard. So much mustard. You ever said a word so many times that it starts to lose all meaning? Mustard. There's mustard in a convenient little squeeze tube. It's like powdered mustard. Mustering of the Mustard Club. <laughs> mustard uses mustard. Mustard Peace Theater. Mustard medicine, the healing powers of mustard? Yes, this is medical grade mustard. You ever felt like you were losing your mind? Supreme Court mustard. Apparently, Barry Levinson, the owner of this museum, was a lawyer. He was arguing, was the, let me see, the assistant attorney general for Wisconsin. He was arguing 
for the Supreme Court, but before he had gone to the Supreme Court, he saw this mustard on a room service tray outside someone's hotel room in his hotel. So he threw it in his pocket and argued in front of the Supreme Court with mustard in his pocket. The world's only mustard vending machine. This is literally shocking. There's actually a small exhibit on horseradish, which apparently is mustard spicy cousin. All right, here we have a championship mustard collection. All these mustards have won awards around the world. Say hello to Tatiana. Former KGB operative is now the World Mannequin Chess Championship. You can play against her. What does that even mean? <laughs> apparently, apparently they will make specialty wedding mustard for you. A special exhibit, rotating exhibit on gray poopa. Some antique mustard jars. Oh, look at that. That's kind of creepy. I've read this story about the yellow M&M three times, and it still makes absolutely no sense. The red M&M ketchup in vain and irresponsibility, while the yellow M mustard is trusting and resourceful. What? It's... I don't... I, uh. this mustard costume. Alright, I do like mustard, but slathering it on a steak like that is straight up nasty. Poop on you. That is pretty funny. They actually sell pet mustard. Mustard for dogs and meow -stard. For cats. Ultimate mustard tasting bar. Okay, we got Merlot. Was it Merlot chocolate? Merlot chocolate mustard. All three of your basic food groups in one. All right. That is weird. <laughs> Interesting. Hmm. You taste all three flavors in there very clearly, distinctly. Uh, we got ghost pepper mustard. It just slowly builds for about 15 seconds, then it just sticks around. Okay. Ooh. Uh, Alright, the ghost pepper mustard may have been a mistake. You get a free honk when you buy something? That is correct. Nice. I right, appreciate you guys watching. This one is in the bag.